In this video, we'll be discussing about Poisson distribution and deriving the mean variance and standard deviation of Poisson distribution. Firstly, understanding the definition, Poisson distribution is regarded as limiting case of binomial distribution. So it is limiting case of binomial distribution. Where n value is very large and p value is very small. So we know what n is, n is the number of trials and p is the probability of success. n value is very large and p value is very small. Such that the product of these two tends to m is equal to np. Here m is constant. So uh, let's move on to, this is Poisson distribution. Now let's move on to Poisson distribution function. So let x be the number of events in a fixed unit of time. So then you can derive the probability as p of x is equal to m power x e power minus m by x factorial. So here m is equal to np that is mean. n is number of trials as we know. x is the required success. Okay, so p of x is called as prob poison probability function and x is called as poison variant. So we also know that a probability function has to satisfy two conditions that is p of x should always be equal to or greater than 0 and the other one is sum of all probabilities should be equal to 1. So now let's move on to the calculating finding the mean of poison distribution. So we all know that uh, probability distribution function p of x is m of x e power minus m by x factorial. This is our first equation. And by discrete random variable, for discrete random variable, mean val mean is x is equal to 0 to n x into p of x. So this p of x will substitute it here. Okay. So our equation changes to <coughs> x, it will be like that only m power x e power minus m by x factorial. Now here x factorial is there, here x is there. So you can cancel x from x factorial. So it will be x into m power x e power minus m by here x into x minus 1 factorial. So this xx gets cancelled. We get the equation as mean is equal to summation x is equal to 0 to n m power x e power minus m by x minus 1 factorial. This can be further written as uh, here x is there so you can split it so it can be written as summation x is equal to 0 to n m into m x minus 1 into e to the power minus m by x minus 1 factorial. So out of this you can take out m and e power minus m and the rest the other things remaining here would be m e power minus m you take it outside. So you will have m x minus 1 by x minus 1 factorial. This is similar to um, Maclaurin series which we have studied that says e to the power x is equal to 1 plus x by 1 factorial plus x square by 2 factorial plus x cube by 3 factorial and so on. Our next step would be uh, finding, uh, considering this entire thing m of x minus 1 by x minus 1 factorial as e power m by using Maclaurin series. Using Maclaurin series by Maclaurin series. So now our equation would change as m e power minus m and here e power m. So it will be m e power minus m plus m e power minus m plus m would become 0. So what we remain what remains here is m. So mean is equal to mu is equal to m. So this is our second equation. Now let's find out the variance. Variance of Poisson distribution. So 
so firstly we, by uh, for discrete random variable variance v is equal to summation x is equal to 0 to n x square p of x minus mu square this is our third equation okay so here we have to take uh, uh, mu square uh, mu value we know that is m so it will be m square here fine now we will take this part x square p of x x square p of x can be written as x square plus x minus x into p of x now further we will club x square minus x and x p uh, and uh, separate x, x from that so it will be x square minus x p of x plus summation x p of x so here so here uh, we have to take x p of x so we know the value of x p of x that is m from uh, like from mean we have calculated right m the mean is m so solving this further x into x minus 1 p of x x square minus x can be written as x into x minus 1 p of x summation x is equal to 0 to n now p of x value let's write it here so x into x minus 1 e to the power minus m into m of x by x factorial so here we have x into x minus 1 here x factorial is there so x into x minus 1 m of x e to the power minus m here below x into x minus 1 x minus 2 factorial so x into x minus 1 x into x minus 1 gets cancelled so our uh, what remains here is summation x is equal to 0 to n m of x e power minus m by x minus 2 factorial which can be further written as which can be further written as uh, let's let's split this x as well so it will be m square into m x minus 2 e power minus m by x minus 2 factorial so here let's take e power uh, e power minus m and m square outside so m square e power minus m outside summation what we have inside is m x minus 2 by x minus 2 whole factorial so by using mclaren series we can term this entire thing as e power we can term this entire thing as e power m plus m so we have uh, e power minus e power m we can term this entire thing as e power m further uh, we can write the equation as m square e power minus m into e power m e power m we got it by using mclaren series so this is the expansion for x square minus x p of x for x p of x it is m and for mu square it is m square so further if you solve this question we get m square e power minus m plus m will cancel plus m minus m square so e m, m, this plus m square this minus m square get cancelled so variance is equal to m so previously mean was also equal to m and here variance is also equal to m next we have to find the standard deviation standard deviation we know that it is under root of variance so under root of m that is under root of m is equal to s so i hope you have understood uh, how to derive the mean variance and standard deviation so of poison distribution i hope uh, the concepts are clear if you have any doubts do let me know in the comments thank you